Sweet corn from things like you're probably more aware of, your popcorn when you go to the cinema, you know, this, this stuff here, okay? That's popping corn and that's made from dried out sweet corn kernels, which as you can see are here. So that's something you'll probably really be aware of. Um, in terms of sweet corn, you'll probably have it home, or maybe on your pizzas or maybe on the side of your plate with some of your meals. You'll have this stuff here, which is prepared sweet corn. It's been cooked and the kernels have been taken off and it's been put in a tin for your convenience. It's fantastic. You can eat this really easily. A little baby ones. Ah, little baby ones there, yeah. So these things here, this is, for me, this is like the ultimate designer veg, really. It's picked off the plant when it's really young and really tender. Um, it's not bad, actually. Mm -hmm. It's pretty good for stir fries and that sort of thing. Really big in Asia. Chinese food, Thai food, that sort of thing. And then the full cob experience, which this is how we grow them here. Can everyone see these? Yeah, everyone's got these? Okay. And when you peel them back, you can see what's inside. Absolutely fantastic looking, yellow, gorgeous, sweet, Lovely. tender cob. I really want to eat it actually. Yeah, me too. Down. We might, we might mm. get a bit more up close and personal with the corn on the cob a little bit later on. So these are all different types of maize. And so maize obviously is really important for food for humans, but mm. it's an important food for animals as well, isn't it? That's right. Maize in its purest form, uh, or field corn as it's known in America, is really about feeding the cattle and feeding the chickens and all the, you know, the, the milk you get and the, and the, and the meat you get uh, from the supermarkets and maybe from your butcher as well, that has to be fed by something. So maize is a really important feed for animals. But when we feed it to ourselves, we don't really like the kind of the maize uh, flavor of things. Maize can be a little bit starchy, not so sweet, maybe a little bit chewy. So we've developed through our really clever breeding programs, sweet corn that tastes and crunch is really nice. It's almost like a fruit, it's that good. So it eats a lot better, and that's why humans like it. So the animals don't mind the, the bland taste, whereas we like it nice and sweet. Absolutely. And can you run, a little birdie told yeah. me, you can run cars and buses using maize. Yeah, believe it or not, yeah. I mean, the high sugar level inside the, the sweet corn, inside the corn on the cob, can be taken from that and turned into ethanol, which can be used as an alternative to fossil fuels. So petrol and diesel, if you're thinking those sorts of things. And alternatively, Maize can also be put through what is known as an anaerobic digestion process. I'm getting a little bit scientific here, but it's basically turned into gas. Okay, the sweet corn breaks down, it, it, it mold takes over, it breaks down, and that gas is captured. And then that gas is put through into engines that, that, that drive combi uh, combined heat and power units. And they can actually make cars work and lorries and tractors. So it's a really sustainable.